I'm Mark Elwood for Dark World in London. So we're here to meet the Queen. No, not that Queen. The Queen of Feet. Margaret Dabbs is a foot maestro to the stars. You could actually call her the soul of discretion. She's also the creator of the world's most expensive pedicure. So let's go check it out. Everybody calls me the Queen of Feet. I really have no idea how I got the name. But aren't feet gross? No, feet aren't gross. And the grosser you feel they are, the better for us. She has nailed a niche in luxury foot care and is trusted to work on London's well heeled, like chef Nigella Lawson, singer Lily Allen, and models such as Sophie Dahl and Lily Cole. She's even the woman Prince Harry's girlfriend Cressida Bonus apparently relies on to hot foot it to the red carpet in style. So you're the stiletto whisperer? Maybe we are, maybe with a stiletto was fresh. And if you're serious about your stilettos, don't settle for anything other than her signature pedicure, one that costs more than most people's mortgage. The world's most expensive pedicure is round about two and a half thousand dollars. So this is part one. This is where we start. This is the biomechanical assessment. We're now going to use the 3D scanner, the laser scanner, in order to make the orthotics that are going to be bespoke to Laura's foot. And this is all about the gait. So it's about making you align, realign the skeleton and walk correctly. Part two is a total nail makeover using a precision laser. The nail laser is all about anybody that has discoloration of the nails, maybe people that have fungal nail infections. So it's all about bringing the nail back to how it originally was. OK, Margaret, so the world's most expensive pedicure continues. Tell me where we are now. What is this? This is our most popular treatment. This is the treatment that people travel from all over the world to go through. It uses a special crushed crystal file and a secret ingredient. Emu oil. It's a massive hydrator. That will transform and take 10 years off the feet, just one application. So my ageing, wrinkly feet will look like a dewy supermodel because of the emu oil. Everybody says, my feet, it looks like I've got baby feet. The world's most expensive pedicure ends with a relaxing massage with soft music and low lights. Finally, a chance to wonder who's going to foot the bill. What if you can't quite stretch to paying 2,500 bucks for a pedicure? First thing that people do, which is a really big error, is they feel that feet should be bathed in water. That's absolutely not the case. If you have an area of foot that's calloused or very, very dry, once the foot is wet, you can't actually see it, so it masks the area to be treated. I've got a confession. I'm a bit embarrassed about my feet. I think they might be too intense for you to cope with, but I took a photo. What do you think? <laughs> Do you know I've seen worse? Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm sure we can fix it. You can do something. Absolutely. All right, all right. This is going to take quite some time, but if anyone can do it, the Queen of Feet can. This is Mark Elwood for Dot World, a little ashamed of my feet right now in London. <laughs>